Good morning, you guys. It is currently 10.05 a.m. And I know what you're thinking, Bailey. I thought we were gonna work on our sleep schedule and not sleep till 10 anymore. Don't worry, don't worry. I've been doing so much better. Um, previous to this week, I've been waking up at like 8, 8.30. Um, but this week, ever since the daylight savings switch happened, I was with my friends that night and we stayed up till literally 5 a.m. Then I got like a few hours of sleep, slept all day on Sunday, and it was just like, it messed me up for the whole week. So my sleep schedule this week hasn't been great, but I woke up at 9 today and then I laid in bed until 9.15 and then I got some work done. So I don't know. I don't think that the day is off to too late of a start. When I woke up this morning, something inside of me was telling me to grab my camera and start filming. I don't know why. I don't... I don't know. Some days I just wake up with this instinct to start recording a YouTube video or to record a podcast that day. Um, so that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna film a little day in my life. I have a bunch of stuff that I kind of need to get done, so I'm just gonna bring you with me and I think it should be kind of fun. I have my little notebook slash journal thing here. I used to use my old journal slash notebook to plan out literally my entire life. I would plan out content, I would plan out plans with friends, I would plan out to-do lists, I would plan out literally everything as well as journal inside of it. I did that in my last one. It's all filled up now. And then I got this new one at the start of the year. And I don't think I've showed you guys this yet, but I made a cute little vision board on the like inside cover and I'm obsessed with it. I just got pictures off Pinterest and then printed them all out and glued them down. Whether you believe it or not, manifestation and vision boards are so powerful. So I literally recommend this idea so much. I love it. But anywho, I was gonna show you that I have a to-do list planned out for today and I'm gonna read off that to-do list very quickly. So number one, I've wake up at a decent time. I didn't wake up as early as I would like to, but um, nine isn't that bad. Number two, I have go to the gym. I've been going to the gym like four times a week pretty much and I've been loving it. It is so nice now that I'm kind of like back into the groove, back into the swing of things. I've been loving it. But then I want to go to TJ Maxx today. This isn't a necessity, this is a want. All of these TJ Maxx, like come shopping at TJ Maxx with me, TJ Maxx hauls are coming up on my TikTok for you page and I am just, I'm missing TJ Maxx. Um, and then I have some grocery shopping I need to get done. And then I want to clean up my room today and do my laundry and then also clean my makeup brushes it's all kind of healing up now i mean it's still definitely there i had a terrible breakout this week i don't know why i don't know how i don't know when i don't know i don't know what's up but my skin was trying to punish me this week and i don't know why like i said so i'm going to clean all my makeup brushes and my beauty blender and all of that in case that has something to do with it it probably doesn't it's probably hormonal or it's probably what i'm eating or something like that but um yeah Okay guys, it's literally only been like 30 seconds since I talked to you last, but I was just going through the memory card on this camera, like swiping through and deleting old footage because it's almost full. And I stumbled across this clip of a smoothie bowl from my favorite smoothie bowl place. And I haven't had one in so, so long. I don't know why I completely forgot that these existed and I literally used to go like twice a week. So I might get a smoothie bowl after my workout today. I don't know why I'm letting you know this, but like I need a smoothie bowl now. I made it to the kitchen and I just found it's St. Patrick's Day, I think. Is today St. Patrick's Day? What the f- Why did no one tell me? Um, I think my friends are having a St. Patrick's Day party tonight and I forgot about it. So I kind of need to go get like a shirt, but I'm gonna make some breakfast. I'm just gonna make a bagel for breakfast. If you guys have been watching my videos lately, I literally make a bagel in like 99% of them. I don't know why I'm still so obsessed with bagels, but I am. Okay guys, I ate my breakfast and then I came upstairs and I hung out with my brother for a little bit because he came home yesterday. So it's kind of been a second, but I finally changed into what I'm gonna wear to the gym. Just wearing this tank top. It's like a workout tank top from Shein's like glow mode workout collection. Their stuff is actually really nice. Um, so if you don't wanna spend like a fortune on like workout clothes try Shein um and then these are some green sweatpants from gray cloud which is Maya Benway's um clothing brand so yeah super comfy we're doing arms today so I like to wear sweatpants or leggings usually I put all of my dirty clothes in this laundry basket and I'm going to put some of it in there before I go to the gym just so I can get ahead of it but yeah I'm gonna head to the gym it's already 11 11 oh make a wish I hate that I do this. I hate how much I procrastinate and how long it takes me to do things because like I want to be done with the gym by 11. You know what I mean? I don't want to be going to the gym at 11.
my workout is done it was really good like really quick like i feel like i was in and out of there pretty fast and like efficient it's 12 44 right now my arms literally feel like jello right now they feel so weak but overall workout was good um, i'm really debating if i want to get a smoothie bowl or not because i'm trying not to spend money on food which isn't going very good i just don't get how people don't eat out like how do you not get bored of the food at your house like i don't eat out every single I don't eat out every single day or like for every meal like I do make myself a lot of food and like I do eat a majority of the time at home but it's like once a day like I, mean, I need I need to spice up my my taste buds it is Friday maybe I should like treat myself okay I need to stop using the phrase treat myself because my whole life consists of me treating myself I hate myself I feel like I can justify anything by saying like oh I'm proud of myself this week for what oops I treated myself, indeed. It was like a dollar extra to add protein to it. So I did that, I added vanilla protein and I hope it's good, let's see. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. The color is a little bit different and like the taste is a tiny bit different but like you can't really tell much. So I might just start getting protein every time. Okay you guys, I have um, post pimple balm on right now, like a recovery cream thing. It's supposed to help with like redness and stuff. So I just let it sit on my face without blending it in for as long as possible. But I just got a package and I know exactly what it is and I wanna unbox it with you guys because I'm so excited. I got a new phone. I went to my phone provider thingy two days ago and I wanted to buy a phone in store but they didn't have one with like enough storage. I wanted the one with like 512 gigabytes of storage or whatever because I take so many pictures, so many videos and it's just kind of a necessity for me. So they ordered one and sent it to my house and it only took two days which is crazy. Yeah, let's open it. All right, so the phone is right here on top. I got the um, iPhone 14 Pro, not the big one. It should be the same size as this one. This is the 12 Pro. I've had it for like two, three years. Whenever it came out, I got it like right when it came out. Um, and it's just getting really slow and it dies like literally four times a day for some reason. I hate that Apple does that. A new phone comes out and then the old phones just go to sh trying to make this satisfying but it's not i literally got the same color phone like it literally i have the silver white one i don't know it's just like my favorite though the cameras are so big all right yeah that's pretty much it i think i'm gonna wait to set this up until i have a case for it because i'm very clumsy and if i break this i'm going to murder myself Okay, hey guys, I, it's been a while. It's literally almost 4 p.m. already. It's 3.37. I totally forgot that I made the commitment to bring my friend Ryan to the auto body shop today to pick up her car. Um, I don't know what was wrong with it, but she got something fixed. Her parents are out of town, so I said that I would drive her there after school, and I forgot. So instead of going to TJ Maxx in the grocery store right now, we're going to get Ryan, and then I'm gonna bring her to her car, and then I'm gonna go to TJ Maxx, and then I'm gonna go to the grocery store. Okay, I just brought Ryan to her car, and I'm at Kohl's in the parking lot. I have decided, I have made the decision, the um, probably smart decision to not go to TJ Maxx today. I literally have no reason to go there, and it would just be because I wanna spend money, and I don't need to spend money, so I'm gonna hold back on that. Um, I do still need to go to the grocery store, though, so I'm gonna hit Kohl's, and then I'm gonna go to the grocery store, and then I'm gonna finish doing all my cleaning, and stuff that I want to get done. All right, so I went to Kohl's, couldn't find a t-shirt. Online it says they had them and then I went in again to look and my location was wrong. Like it had me in Nebraska or some shit. So point is, didn't get a shirt. That's okay. I did pick up some stuff from Sephora. Little haul, $72 for two things. I need to stop. I had to restock on two of my favorite products, so I got the Kosas Revealer Concealer. I always get the shade 4.5N. It's my favorite concealer, and I'm almost out of it, so I got that. And then I finally got my hands on the Charlotte Tilbury contour wand now they said or they didn't say nobody said anything but um the display had one contour wand on display and it was like the darker one like the deep one and they only had the lighter one in stock so i don't know if this is like the right color but hopefully oh i think that'll be good i don't know i'm just happy to have it happy to have it baby okay i'm gonna go into the grocery store oh yeah yeah 
hi i am a mess right now i have been a mess all day i do not know what is going on with me i just feel like i'm all over the place and like i always am all over the place but today it feels like extra extra all over the place i literally got back from the grocery store like two hours ago and i haven't picked up my camera once like why i feel like i should just scrap all of the footage and just like start over tomorrow like try to film a different video because i feel like this is just not good i'm sorry i'm just struggling um but anywho i got back from the grocery store i didn't get a whole lot i got a pineapple a baguette <laughs> i got pb fit powder protein bars cashews and then i just got like panty liners and some pimple patches and some other little things that i needed oh I also got sushi and then I ate the sushi when I got home and then I put all the groceries away and then I came up here and I've been editing with all my podcast episodes. I take the podcast after it's fully been edited and then I have to cut it down into short form little clips so that I can post those to like TikTok and Instagram to promote the episode. Um, so I just made like six short form clips for my podcast that's coming out in a few days. I've kind of been sitting here. I filled out some tax information. I don't know. Like I've just been like kind of working, getting kind of some of that stuff done, but it's getting late. It's Friday night. I need to start like thinking about what I'm gonna do tonight if I want to do something but my room is still kind of messy and I need to take care of it it's not like a horrible mess but there's just like I don't know like there's just some stuff in places that there shouldn't be stuff so I'm just gonna like clean up a little bit and then I really don't know <laughs> I don't know I feel like I'm literally losing my mind I'm so sorry for what this video is I am getting flashbacks to like vlogmas when I was just like filming vlogs over and over and over and they were like so terrible because I was like not in the mood at all I woke up this morning and I was so ready to film like I like I was talking about like I had an instinct that today was gonna be a good day to film and then it completely took a different turn so I'm sorry it's it's it is what it is. <laughs> I got this new makeup bag off of um, Amazon. It's like a little travel makeup bag and I literally love this. I have it linked in my um, Amazon storefront under Am- er, Oh my god, I'm all- <laughs> I have it linked under my travel essentials little category. But look how freaking cute. So it's like a little pink bag and then there's a zipper in the front that you can put stuff in. And then there's like these little like- strap things like loops you can put your products in like upright all around it and then there's like little mesh pockets here and then this is for your brushes you put the brush handles in here you can see my fingers go in there and then like the brushes are covered so i don't get dirty or like get other stuff dirty love and it's leather so like if it gets dirt so cute and it was very inexpensive this is another thing I just got you guys look how freaking cute not even like cute But if I could let you try these on virtually right now, I would um, these are just a pair of like the cloud slides from Amazon They're literally so thick and so squishy. I literally I am obsessed They were like way too big on this part like my foot was super loose in them right when I got them <sighs> Why am I so out of breath? But then I remember seeing like on the Amazon listing that it was saying you could like customize The size of these and like custom fit them to your feet And all I needed to do was put them on my feet and blow dry them and like make them super hot And then they literally shrunk and they fit me like perfectly now and i'm not lying when I say they're literally the comfiest thing i've ever put on my feet like they're squishy if you like have foot problems or like just want a comfy pair of shoes get these i'll link them on my storefront <laughs> hi queens i <laughs> i've been crying off and on for a little bit now i don't want anybody to be worried um i get my period in a few days and this happens every single month i just get so emotional for no reason like the couple days leading up to my period and also like any minor inconvenience will just like set me off um i'm sure a lot of girlies can relate to that but um i didn't do anything tonight it's 11 30 i stayed in i kind of had the option to go somewhere and then People are just weird, um, and I was getting really bad vibes. So I decided to stay in. Um, I was gonna hang out with my boyfriend, but he had plans with his friends, and I was like, go do that, like, go have fun. I'm just gonna, like, take a night to myself. So I just took a bath, took a nice long bath, did a face mask, um, and now I'm watching some March Madness, and everything is good, everything is good. But I just wanted to come in here and say hi, because I literally have not been doing my job in this video, like at all. Like I haven't been vlogging anything. I'll just like not talk to you for three hours and then come back and update you, and I'm sorry for that. But I already apologized for this video earlier, so I'm gonna save you the sob story. Um, right before I turn 
turned on these basketball games I was cleaning my makeup brushes and then I like checked the score and there was like a really close game So I turned it on and then I took a little break, but I have to clean a few more makeup brushes My cheeks right now are so flushed for no reason and it's making my skin look even worse than it is This video is not progressing in the right direction. So I'm gonna end it. I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. And if you made it to this point, I'm honestly proud of you because I don't know if I could sit through this whole video. Me editing this, I'm going to want to, you know? Thanks so much for watching. Um, subscribe, follow all of my social medias, tune into the podcast if you haven't already. I promise it's a really fun time over there and I've honestly been loving it so freaking much. I love you. Bye-bye.